friends welcome back to my studio I've got something pretty awesome to share with you today and I am really excited about this and also I really want your feedback so let's uh, let me just put you down and I can show you what I'm talking about okay so what I've been doing recently is I've been creating these sets of artwork and I have run which one have I run? I've run this one recently in a workshop and this went down really well. The reason why I wanted to do it in like this was two reasons. One is that through our club we've got uh, a project on the go which is the Duck Cottage which I, I'll link a couple of the videos below. It is a 148th scale which is the smallest painting in, down the end. And this one here is more sort of a large 112th, maybe 16th, 112th, 124, 148. So I've been painting a few of these. I've got this one, which is a, a set of flowers. And then I've got this one, which is a tree house and with a tree. Uh, I've got a couple of landscape ones that I've also done as well. So I've got five of these done already. And so what I wanted to do was have the ability to be able to put these online in order for anybody who might be interested to be able to purchase them. So I've actually created an Etsy store, so I'll put the link to that in the description below. And on the store, I've actually recreated these into an A4, A5 printable. So this is a printable that you can purchase and download so it's a digital copy and then print it out yourself and it is of all the four scales so what I'm keen to know is that from all of you is does it make sense to have four different scales in the one like printable um, it's the same picture and it's all different scales or would you just simply purchase it and then scale it down yourself the other thing is if if not, would it make more sense to have maybe multiple different paintings of the same scale in the one printable? That makes sense. So having like all of these smaller ones on the one or having all of the larger ones on one, one printable. So larger ones, but all the same scale, but different prints or the same print, but all different scales anyway I'd love to I'd love to know your feedback the other thing that I am currently working on is creating these as that are already framed this is a frame that I got and it does actually come in the four four different scales and so this was another reason why I wanted to do them in this particular size because they fit this this particular frame and then there's there is one more which is the really small one so I'm thinking of actually selling these as like this so already framed and painted gold I've only got gold ones at the moment but I'm also thinking of put, painting some in silver uh, or actually just having them black because they're just in a black resin and where you can paint them yourself so you could potentially get a set of frames so there's this one um, there's also this frame which is more simple um, this is one that I designed myself and so that's got a lot, a lot more simpler frame, probably a little bit more. No, it's not really modern, but it's a simpler frame. And then I've also got a, a much larger frame as well that I've actually downsized from a file as well. So there is there's three options of frames. There was potentially two color ways, so gold or silver. And then there's also five prints, so that gives me a lot of options. But again, would it make more sense to be able to buy a set of prints and frames together, so all, all four? Or actually, would it make more sense to sell these individually? So that's my conundrum at the moment. And I'd love your feedback on that as well. So yeah, so far away, I'm really keen to hear your thoughts around like miniature art these are all original they're all painted by me all painted by hand so these are actually the originals here which I'll end up by keeping hold of for now and then these are these are the actual prints of them so they're all cut down these all fit so if you bought the frames 
and the prints they they match uh, the sizes absolutely match so you, all you need to do is cut them out and stick them into the frames and so yeah that's kind of that's where I am at the moment so yeah fire your feedback back to me I'm really interested to hear what you have to say and go and check out the Etsy store and let me know if there's anything that I've missed that doesn't make sense that you know that I need to add change tweak please just let me know and other than that until next time everybody I'll see you then bye for now